Good day everyone, my name is Ruslan and welcome to my YouTube channel. So guys, um, how have you been? Well, I hope good. I hope everything is fine. I hope you're enjoying my videos. Uh, do share and subscribe, right? Like my videos if you find them interesting and if you um, if you learn something from them. So you know, check this out. Today I've made a very simple structure and uh, it's according to the reference image, guys. So we are going to be making this awesome parametric um, Backy today inside Revit it may not be parametric that's fine but as long as the shape is this so we're going to be making this inside Revit today this is uh, the French language international center inside Beijing right and it looks very awesome so um, check this out I quickly went to Revit and I kind of replicated the structure that is shown all right so this is the walkway these are the columns these are the two floors so one two and three and four and this is the exact same thing I did right here after that I made a reference place right here and I made um, the simple shape using model lines I changed it into a reference line and then I selected that I added a solid surface and I converted the surface into a pattern and I set the size of the pattern to be uh, 1.2 meters by 1.2 meters all right so check this out um, this is uh, gonna end up looking like this. So let's quickly go to our um, curtain uh, panel family, all right? This is what we are gonna be using. So the first thing is always the UN. Let's change the units to millimeters, uh, two decimal places, and okay, okay. Now, guys, you have to follow along, right? There are so many different steps that we have to do, and the size of this is gonna be according to what we set. Perfect 1.2 meters by 1.2 meters. So now make sure you follow along, right? There are going to be quite a few points that we'd have to place. This is going to be one, two, and three, and the one, <laughs> excuse me, guys, two and three, and the one and two and three, and the one and the two and the three, and the one and the two and the three, and one and the two and the three. Oh my God! So, <laughs> so many points. After that, we have to start connecting. So let's click on that. Let's click on that. Um, both of them are 0 0.5, isn't it? And uh, now just simply go to line and uh, reference line and perfect. So that is done. After that, let's click on that. This is 0 point, uh, 0 point, uh, point what, point 0.2. Okay, and then we have this one right here. So this is again, <coughs> excuse me, if we turn the other way around, this is again 0 0.2. Um, so both of them are connected and the spline. And reference line and the same thing right here so this is gonna be the the 0 0.8 mark right 0 0.8 and 0 0.2 are basically the same thing and this is gonna be the 0 0.2 mark so that is selected control and uh, drag this mouse and um, what we did another mistake so drag control and drag and the spline and uh, mm, spline and uh, reference line all right and let's change our battery to high performance okay it is already the best performance oh my god um so after that let's click on this point right here let's click on this point so spline and uh, reference line and uh, right this point and uh, control and this point and uh, spline and uh, uh, after that let's connect click that and a uh, reference line and uh, one point right here and one point right here and spline and a reference line and check this out guys everything is perfect after that let's try to control this point right here so the size uh, I mean the distance of this is going to be the coefficient of this is going to be 0 0.9 this one is going to be 0 0.8 and this one right here is going to be 0 0.7 perfect um, after that the same case is going to be with this one so this is going to be um, 0 0.1 and uh, this one <coughs> excuse me this is going to be 0. Point, uh, not 124 oh my god 0 0.2 and this one right here is going to be 0 0.3 um, all right perfect now is the same thing the other on the other side so this is going to be the the 0 0.1 mark and that's the 0 0.2 mark and this one right here is the 0 0.3 mark uh, perfect after that we bring it right here this is going to be the 0 0.9 mark and uh, this one right here is going to be the 0 0.8 mark and uh, this one right here is going to be the 0 0.9 0 0.8 and 0 0.7 mark perfect and uh, all of these are fixed right this is 0 0.2 and this is 0 0.5 and fixed right so now um let's connect that uh, i mean let's click that control and click and spline and reference line and uh, <coughs> excuse me oh my god my sore throat uh, 
click both of them and spline and reference line and uh, click on that and uh, control and click on that and uh, spline and reference line and check this out so so much progress until now and this is the overall grid all right so let's quickly get started the first is the pipe and the pipe and the circle and the plane and the set click on this point click on that and 20 mm what come on so circle and set and uh, click on this point 20 mm right you have to zoom in the screen set and 20 mm perfect now let's click on this point let's click on this point and make a profile all right our progress is on point our progress is perfect so the two pipes are already made as you guys can see these are the pipes they're already made right so um that is done now after that we kind of uh, need something in the middle right so point right here and this is going to be the rectangle and this is going to be the set set it at this point bring it right here drag it perfect after that let's go to tab and this is gonna be the 150 mm and uh, let's click on this point and this is gonna be the 50 mm and uh, let's click on this rectangle let's go to move and uh, let's click on that and let's click on that perfect so this is the profile that we are going to be using all right 150 mm on both the sides now let's try to click on this point let's click on this point and control C and now uh, control V and control V and control V. So one, two, and three, or four, this is done. After that, control V and control V and control V and control V. Oh my God. So, you know, the overall shape is, in, it's nothing hard. It's very easy. So, um, um, I mean, come on. Um, so let's click on this point and pick a new host. And uh, this is going to be the, okay, if he, if he does not want to get into the right orientation. Uh, after that, let's click on this point and this is going to be the pick host. And, uh, okay, let's just paste it right here. After that, let's click on that and this is going to be the pick new host. And uh, let's place it right here. Let's grab our cursor. Let's grab our point and let's try to drag it right here perfect after that let's uh, grab on this point and uh, let's try to drag it to this point and uh, perfect guys um after that let's grab on this point and let's try to drag this to this point here you go and uh, let's drag on that and let's try to what come on um right okay that is to the point final point so one and two um and uh, make profile and here you go one and uh, two and make profile and check this out all right uh, perfect so um after that let's grab on this point let's pick a new host and uh, this is gonna be from this point to um this point so after that uh, that is uh, okay uh, how about we click on that and uh, pick a new host and uh, right what okay if it's not in the right orientation we can simply manually do it so grab it grab it grab it all right and uh, let's just grab this point right here and let's grab this point right here and let's make it okay here you go very easy nothing hard after that let's uh, just pick up this point and uh, let's try to drag that right here and this is um, um so pick this point and uh, pick me host and uh, right here perfect after that you simply grab that and perfect okay done and after that you simply grab on that and perfect right here so you grab this and uh, you grab that and you make it perfect so check this out guys our profile is already made now press tab on that and uh, ta -ta 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 -ta. okay for the materials new this is gonna be the wood and uh, okay okay and uh, tab again to click on that and this is again going to be the wood and uh, click on this point right here and this is again going to be the wood and uh, tab click on this point right here this is again going to be the wood and uh, tab right here and this is going to be the the p i p e the pipe and then click on this point right here so this is gonna be the pipe pipe so now um let's go back to quickly 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 we do not want to waste more time so for the pipe material you know i want something um, w h i t e something um acoustic ceilings and uh, laminate white okay let's go for this 
and uh, for the word right here uh, w -O, o d um something nice so or uh, okay wooden planks is that good or this mahogany one this one seems nice so okay okay and uh, now just load it into the project and uh, let's grab on this one right here and uh, let's try to so this is what was this this was family seven family seven where are you and uh, check this out guys so our beautiful facade is already complete and look at how nice it looks and uh, check our reference image out and check this out so it is exactly to the point check this out and uh, it's perfect right and check our one out for example if you go to a realistic view and uh, let's go to matching insight and let's close that um we do not want to see that yes here you go so this is it right <laughs> exactly according to our reference image and uh, for example from this angle and this one extra family no problem we can delete that so this is our reference image and this is our point right so i hope you enjoyed the video and i hope you learned something from that and of course you can play with the sizes of these for example if you want the pipe to be a bit thick or anything so take care of yourself and uh, bye bye